What is up YouTubers? Figured with this week being Shark Week, we dive on into some shark themed hot sauces that we picked up from Jungle Gems. I'm Hot Sauce Mike, and let's get started. This week we're gonna be testing out some spicy shark. And we're gonna go with Mako Snake, Amagata, and the original. And yeah, let's do some reviews because I don't think I've had them on the channel before. So let's go give them a try. Figured I'd bring the tasting party out to my car since I'm on lunch break. So we're gonna start this party off by doing the OG sauce, the original. But ow. Um, the ingredients list, what we got in here are bell peppers, carrots, onions, apple cider vinegar, habanero peppers, lemon juice, banana, water, garlic, fennel, ginger, salt, sunflower oil, fruit pectin, sugar, orange extract, organic fruit, and vegetable juice for color. Damn, no preservatives, everything's all or natural i can dig that uh, on the heat spectrum it's a uh, three out of five fins there we go let's get this bad boy go that was pretty easy look at that color too i can smell the fruitiness to it it's just like a it smells like a fruit salad with some spice Making a mess in the car. Cheers. Look at that color too. That flavor profile is pretty, pretty damn good. It's unique. You got the sweetness and notes up front, but then the heat's more on the back end. It's a nice consistency. It's a little runny, but. Damn, a little of this will go a long way due to the flavor profile being amazing. <laughs> what would I use this on? I could use this on pizza for sure. Eggs, quite a few different type of things. Anything you, if you, anything you want to enhance the flavor and heat, this is your go-to. Let's try the next one. All right, next one up is the Hama Gaeta from the Six Fin series. Check it out. Wow. All right, let's check out the ingredients. Holy shit, this sauce is gonna wreck me, I can already tell. First ingredient is the scorpion pepper. Next up is the vinegar, onion, roasted red pepper, molasses, garlic, celery, habanero pepper, pineapple juice, banana, tomato, almond flour, sunflower oil, Carolina reaper pepper, seven pop, primo pepper, chocolate chili powder. Whew. And then we've got seasonings, liquid smoke, paprika, salt, coffee puree, and spices. Contains tree nuts. Damn, that's a lot of ingredients, and it sounds pretty damn good. But the scorpion pepper always tends to light my ass up, so yeah, I have a feeling it's gonna knock my socks off. Check out the artwork, though. I like it. It's like a hammer med, a hammerhead, and a baby. I had a baby with an alligator. And the heat on this guy, it's oh shit, extreme heat. Six fins, and yeah, it's gonna be hot. All right, let's crack this bad boy open. Ah. Ooh, you smell like the cocoa in there. Damn, this one smells pretty damn good too. Doesn't smell anything like the last one we just tried. And this one doesn't really have a fruit smell to it like the uh, prior one. This one smells more like coffee and chocolate. Uh, not trying to make a mess. <laughs> so I'm digging that. Yeah, heat though is just like right there in the front. Ooh. <coughs> oh shit. <coughs> Damn. I think I put a little bit too much of that one. <coughs> it's just hitting the back of my throat. The flavor on it is pretty damn good. 
Yeah, I would use this on like rice or something. It's got like a different flavor profile than what I was expecting. It's got like some chocolatey notes to it. But the heat is like right up there in the front. And it drags all the way going down. This shit would definitely go a long way. It's just so damn hot, I would not use it as much as often. <laughs> definitely is a six spin sauce. Last but not least, we got the Mako Steak. Mako Steak. Steak. Uh, last but not least, we got the Mako Snake. Oh, check out the artwork of this guy. And this one is as well part of the Six Fin series. So this one's probably gonna be hot as fuck too. Yo, that heat is just lingering, man. Hold on, I gotta take a break. I need a hummus with some pita. Ready ingredients list. What we got? Coconut milk, apple cider vinegar, water, mango, ghost pepper, bell pepper, habanero, onion, Carolina reaper, sugar, garlic, banana, sweet potato, pineapple, maple syrup, sunflower oil, sesame, yeah, sesame oil, tamarind, cumin, ginger, cinnamon, coriander, onion powder, garlic, uh, safotida, whatever the hell that is, clove, caraway, cardamom, star anise, salt, and fenugreek. In a group, feed a Greek. Huh. There are a few words that I cannot pronounce that I've never even heard of before. And then, yeah, let's crack it open. The heat level on this one again, six fins, just like the last one. This time, I don't think I'm gonna go as heavy as I did with the last one. <laughs> smell and all the spices not much smell from like the fruits like the first one you know what we got this bad boy we'll use oh she's a little thicker than normal uh -oh. i think i overdid it cheers that flavor and the heat on this one is nowhere as near as the other one we just did the hammer gator i'm really digging this one flavor is phenomenal that's the one thing i like about all three of them the taste were all different nothing was the same heat levels were all different but the flavor profiles were all different as well, which is what I like. I don't like it where you'll get three sauces and they almost have the identical ingredients and they almost taste the same. These guys are very unique and they're all in their own little way. Definitely check them out. If you haven't tried a spicy shark yet, I highly recommend it. It's time for my ass to get back to work. I'm Han Sauce Mike and thanks for tuning in. Later.